Hi, my name is Norman. And I'm Dr. Z, or Dr. Zarkloff. And uh, we are here to show you the tool bag of mine that I'm going to be doing a contest of giving away my tools. I had to purchase new ones and I had to buy a different tool bag that would suit my knees a little bit easier for me. Okay? Okay, Norman. Uh, let's go through some of those tools that you have in your tool bag and explain what they're used for. This is my trusty screwdriver. Well, you mean that's a new one. Uh, Norman had to buy a new one recently because, you see, he'd been using his old one as a chisel and uh, we couldn't give that one away. It's a, this one's a six-in-one screwdriver. And uh, I, I hope you like it. This is my tape. This is what I use to tie Grandma up once in a while. Shh, don't notice, tell her. Notice it's partially used. Well, don't you know where it went. either, okay? She deserved it. And my trusty oil. You know, when you chisel those tools down, sometimes you got to oil them a little bit so they work a little bit better. That's right. And you know, you can actually repair just about anything with duct tape and oil. Because you see, if it's not supposed to move, use duct tape to fix it. And if it's supposed to move and it's not, you use oil so that it'll move. So and. When I tied up Grandma, she wasn't moving, and I knew she was going to be mad, so I put some oil all over her to let her go. Good choice. Uh, That's a mini hacksaw. Just a, it's something for homeowners out there. Uh, if you don't do a whole lot of uh, hacking, then that would probably uh, help you out quite a bit to cut through a bolt every now and then. It also helped me to cut the tape to get the tape off besides the oil off the grandma. That helps. Just got to be careful not to cut grandma with it. The meter. This is a meter. I use this on my air conditioner when Dr. Z is not available. Although he told me I better not touch something that is going to shock me. So, uh, yeah. so that'll tell you, that'll just tell you if you have power or not. It'll test 120 volts, 240 volts, 277 volts, and 480 volts. It'll tell you which voltage you have. It's kind of handy to have in a tool bag. Whoa, what do we got here? I showed it to Grandma, and especially she when she was like tied it. up, she didn't like it at all. She took her, she said, get that away from me. <laughs> now, that is a, a very used item that uh, Norman had been using for many years to cut holes in the walls. Grandma's not happy about it, but that's the price you pay, I guess, to have Norman living with you. Oh, my trusty wrench. Yeah. It goes in all different sizes, see? It gets bigger, now it gets smaller. It's a nice toy, too. And uh, it'll double as a hammer, but to keep you people from using it as a hammer, we got a hammer. Yep. I kind of made some holes in the walls with a hammer too. Grandma wasn't happy. No. This is my tape measure. 
And it's got fractions on here, and I don't know how to use fractions. I don't know what to do with fractions, not at all. Everything rounds off to the nearest inch with Norman. And folks, that's all I have in my bag. But this is my, tra my, my bag that I take with me. But I'm willing to give it up because I've got a new one, okay? I hope you enjoy. Wait a minute, we forgot. Oh, what? Don't, don't you see your books? Oh! You know, I've read all your books. Okay. And um, I really like them. I take them to the bathroom with me. And uh, people don't know if I'm reading mm -hmm. or if I'm working. Okay, we'll put a couple in there too. All right? Okay. You heard it from him. He's going to give up two of his books. It's Interterrestrial and Life on the Meridian. Thanks, guys. You need to leave a comment in order to uh, be considered for a contestant in my drawing. And you have to be subscribed to Dearest Becky. And if you want to subscribe to Dr. Z, that would be wonderful also. And Dudley, he don't have a channel yet, but he loves you to hell. He loves to play. That's all, folks.